sometimes you just got to get out in traffic and see what the heck is on sale. Let's go shopping, baby. Hello, hello, hello. I hope you guys are doing wonderful. I hope you are doing well. Welcome to the channel of Birth and Bosses with Felicia and I am Felicia. Guys, listen, for those of you that are returning, I want to say welcome back. Thank you so much for watching my videos and sticking and staying and supporting the channel, you guys. So listen, today we are out shopping, going to see what we can find to get um, ready for next year, Valentine's Day, to see what we can get to get ready for mother's day and for easter as well guys so yeah i want to let you know that we're going to go buy a few stores my shirt don't want to act right today but we're going to go buy a few stores to see exactly what we can find how oh, guys let me know in the comments what you guys have been able to find what stores you've been to and when you went and found what you found and that way it'll help all of the subbies and me as well find items that um that are in maybe in our area as well guys so yeah i am just really excited about what i am going to find today hope i find lots of great things i know a lot of you watched um my video shopping haul yesterday um shopping video shopping haul video <laughs> today from yesterday okay i could not get that out but anyway, y'all, um, yeah, so I did find some amazing things while I was out yesterday at TJ Maxx and City Trends as well. And like I said, the things that I bought from City Trends were a little pricier than what I normally pay for them. But nevertheless, I went ahead and grabbed them since most of the stores are running out of inventory or are not getting as much inventory as they were prior to COVID-19, okay? So yeah, guys, I wanna let you know cause someone had made a, a long post in one of my comments, I mean, under one of my videos in the comment section about um, me uh, making videos while I'm driving, okay? Now, I'm very, very safe and careful when I drive. Um, I'm not a texter, texter when I drive. I, um, very very rarely make videos while I'm riding down the street. If you'll go back and look at most of my videos, they are um, videoed while I am um, sitting in a parking lot, okay? Um, and also, when I do live videos, which causes me to keep looking back and forth at the camera, that is when I'm sitting still, okay? I'm not, I think I might have did one um, live video while I was riding down the street, but that was only because I was almost at my destination. So I'm, I'm thankful for y'all's concern, but I want to let you know I'm very careful at what I do and I'm very mindful um, as well. I would never do anything to put myself in jeopardy or the people around. So I just wanted to get that out and um, I didn't want to have to explain all of that in writing. I simply didn't have the time um, to do that. But um, like I said, I appreciate the concern. I really do. But um, yeah, I'm being very, very careful. And when I do make videos that I have to read comments, I'm either about to pull into a location. Um, and also my mount is sitting right here on my dashboard. So I'm not looking away or looking around or anything like that. It's no more um, glancing at your dashboard every now and then than you glancing in your rearview mirror to see who is behind you. So I just wanted to let you guys know that, okay? Enough of that, y'all. So yeah, so the first stop we're gonna make is at another City Trends. I went to one and I didn't have time to go to another because I had church last night. I had church in the morning. Yeah, guys, so I didn't get a chance to go to the other city trends, but we are going to that one today. And hopefully they will have some more great and awesome things, y'all. So anyway, I will see you in a few. Oh, I forgot to tell y'all, like, share, comment, and subscribe. If this is your first time on this channel, make sure you subscribe. And guys, I want to remind you too, make sure you hit the like, not just when I'm on live, but when you're watching the videos as well, make sure that you hit the like 
budding okay it helps the videos and it helps me get into the youtube algorithm so okay we'll see y'all in a few minutes bye Y'all know this is my type of clearance. I love those yellow stickers, y'all. Okay, y'all, so we are back in the car. Y'all, look, we got an amazing haul. We got lipstick here. Well, we got an amazing haul. Why do, why do we put on lipstick and knowing that the mask going to mess it up? I don't know. And then nobody's going to see it. Y'all, I got some awesome, awesome things out of there. I had gotten so many of these. They were marked down to $2, okay? I know they have them at Dollar Tree for $1.25. And at some stores, roses and different stores I've been in, you can get them for like two in a pack for a dollar. But these are really thick and fluffy. Y'all, they were $2. Now, I got about 10 packs of these. Now, when I got to the register, she told me that some of them won $2. I'm trying to figure out... If it's the exact same pack, exact same label, she told me they had different SKU numbers. So, hey, y'all know how computers are. It was the exact same product price. I mean, everything was exactly the same, but they weren't on sale. Okay, I got these lipsticks here for $1, $1. Guys, and it has how many pieces? I don't need to tell you, one, two, three, four, five five piece matte ultimate sheer lipstick okay that is gonna be amazing these were my favorite finds who don't like a nice journal y'all these were marked down to two dollars the regular price was four dollars okay so they were half off now and um city trends some of the stuff is not that high to start with okay I, your girl is just really cheap that's all don't pay me no mind y'all this was three dollars and i normally would be paying like a dollar and something for these because they carry these at dollar general as well i'm praying y'all i can get a lot of sets from dollar general but we will see here is another um type of journal i got this one has warrior and it warrior and it has a breast cancer um survival sign on it so i may make a breast cancer because i'm sure somebody's mom 
somebody to come get something for their mom out of all the people that i serve somebody is going to have dealt with breast cancer so here we have a headband to keep your hair nice while you sleep or when you get in the shower it was one dollar um what else we get oh i got this for men for um father's day or whenever i'd like to keep things at home these were only a dollar these are nobleman face and body cleansing wipes and it is a really thick pack for one dollar and one of my favorite finds were these umbrellas for two dollars and y'all okay they're not that sturdy so i didn't get them all but i did get them because i think this is gonna be cute in a basket for mother's day and last but not least and these items that i'm showing y'all i got multiple ones of it but what's the purpose of showing you 25 of the same thing make that make sense i ain't got the time and i know y'all don't either okay this was a great this is retinol it's a good brand has the shower gel and the and it's the anti-aging shower gel and the anti-aging lotion for three dollars and y'all the regular price on this was um let's see it got i think 12.99 is like the comparison price for another store let me see if i can get this tag off Y'all, they got about four, five um, clearance stickers up here. Compare at 20. Okay, so the regular price was $12.99 in City Trends. And they marked these down to $3. And as you can see, this is a really big bottle. So I got two of each of these. That's all they had. I cleared the shelf. Now, again, I am cheap, okay? So, I normally wouldn't have paid $3 for this bottle of shower gel. I know y'all might what? But, yeah, I don't pay much at all for my items. I just keep searching and searching until I find the right stuff. Um. So, anyway, off to the next store, baby. Let's go. So we are just coming out of roses and y'all, uh, I got absolutely nothing but this sparkling water that I love to get from roses. I love, um, well, some sparkling water. Being that I only drink water, I got to get a little kick from something every now and then. So yeah, I got some sparkling water. And I don't know, y'all. I reckon we might ride to Big Lots. See what they got. Since everybody been in the comments talking about Big Lots. Okay, we're going to see what they got. All right. Let's ride. Okay, y'all, so, T not TJ Maxx, Big Lots in my city has absolutely nothing, okay? 
I can never find anything at Big Lots. But I tried to give them a try. I tried, I tried. But y'all, I didn't see absolutely nothing in there that looked like a clearance. I'm definitely not a Big Lot shopper. But I will come, you know, after the seasons and see if I can get something on sale. But I can never find anything. I don't know if people be beat me to it or people might just buy it all before the season is out. So, I don't know, y'all. It's getting dark. I thought I was in a shopping, shopping, shopping mood, meaning I could just go all day long. But I'm realizing that I really want to go home. <laughs> Trying to think of one more store I could go to that would be a really good hit. But I don't know. And y'all, it is gotten really cold and windy out here. I'm like ready to go home and jump up under my blanket. It's really how I'm feeling. But we'll see if we should go to one more store, guys. Okay, so we did end up at Walmart. We didn't buy anything, but they definitely did have clearance. Stay tuned for another video where I will show you everything that I purchased from other stores. Thanks, Crafty Black Girl. I finally got the music right.